All right. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the streamies. So, uh, yeah. We have, I think, two chapters left in Digimon here. So, we have uh, chapter 11 today. Tonight, this morning, whatever. And then uh, chapter 12 on Wednesday. Uh... Considering that's the last chapter, I'm expecting some shit to go down in this chapter. Theoretically. We kind of need a reason to end on a cliffhanger so that we'll be going into the next chapter being like, Oh man, we gotta, we gotta fuck them up. We gotta, we gotta kill them all, Peter. That kind of stuff. So, uh, yeah. We'll see how this goes. Usually I don't uh, stream on Sunday nights. Because it's basically, I come home from work and then, you know, back to work. But, uh, yeah, what can you do? So, uh, yeah. If it's anything like the other fucking chapters lately, it'll be like, oh, I don't know, like two hours? Two and a half? So, we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. We'll see if we can keep the, uh, the casualties at two so far. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Closing, shrinking the world I created. If I don't hurry, I too will be. No, I will not allow it. I cannot stop. My ultimate desire will be realized. Thus. Whatever that is. Child. Uh. Where am I? The offering. Quickly, the offering! I hear something. What is that? Good morning, my dear priestess. You're what? Just hearing that voice sent shivers down my spine. It's like it's directly inside my head. This is too much. Whatever you are, you're scaring me. I will not hurt you. Who are you? Are we actually going to get an answer to that? Oh, precious Miyuki, you are my life! What? Now come. Come here. Here? You want me to come to you? Without you, my ultimate desire will not be realized. Your ultimate desire? You mean there's something you want? I cannot forgive that wretched family. Therefore, Miyuki. Therefore! He seems angry. Oh, you know, just a little bit. Like, really angry. Just a little bit. Come now, Miyuki. Come to me. To me. And if I do, what are you going to do to me? Hurry now, come to me! No, I don't want to! Don't leave me, no, my precious priestess. Please, don't leave me! What's going on? My head feels weird, like my mind's being taken over. I can't take this. No, no! I can't let him have his way, I know that much, but still. What am I supposed to do about it? After that sudden battle with the Master at the library, why is Renamon just staying as Haru all the time now? Shouldn't Renamon just, you know, be Renamon all day every day now? We made up with Haru, uh, Renamon, since we all have to s since we all want to save Miyuki. And then made it safely back to school. After that, everyone passed out like logs, including Renamon, who was injured. The next morning, Renamon gathered everyone in the cafeteria when we woke up. Renamon, what's going on? Why'd you take on Haru's form again? We know who you really are now, so why keep pretending? I've looked this way for so long that my body naturally takes on his appearance. 
Huh. But yesterday you looked like Renamon. Well, I can't fight in this form, obviously. So basically, Haru's form is more natural for you at this point. Like, you feel more relaxed in his body. That's... that's weird. That's weird. Hey, don't ignore me. Oh, shut up. After all that time at Miyuki's side as Haru, I just started to feel right. But isn't it painful to stay in that form? At first it was, but the strangeness of it has worn off over time. And I like the look on Miyuki's face when she sees me. So you can forget what I said yesterday. Intriguing. So why'd you call us here? You you got something important to announce? Right, I thought we should talk about where Miyuki is. You mean you know? Miyuki is in the shrine. The shrine? You mean the inner shrine from before? That's the one. Are you certain? You think I'd lie to you at this point? The master's true body is in the inner shrine. So Miyuki is there too. She must be. I don't think he's lying, Takuma. But if that's true... I can't believe it. The Master and Miyuki have been right under our noses. Looks like everyone else is just as surprised as I am. I'm shocked. I never thought the enemy could be so close. We've, we've walked around there so many times. I know. It never even crossed my mind. Like they say, it's easiest to miss what's right in front of you. The shrine didn't seem large enough to hide multiple p people, though. Maybe the inner area goes farther than I thought. But I searched the shrine so many times, I can't believe it. We're working together on this, right? Or do you doubt me? Miyuki used to say Haru was really stubborn and never changed his mind. So I guess I'm just being the same old Haru. That's an interesting way to put it. But it's easy to see where the professor is coming from, right? In other words, you don't trust me. That's not what I mean. I just, like, want some proof. It will make sense if we go to the shrine. Will it? Renamon isn't offering much in the way of details. But like Agumon said, he doesn't seem to be lying. I trust Renamon. Renamon wants to help Miyuki and wouldn't lie about her. I can't disagree with you there. Just look at those eyes! They look like Sayokomons did when he protected me, all intense. <laughs> I guess that's the look of wanting to protect someone you care about. True. Plus, we all know how bad Renamon wants to save Miyuki. We can trust him on this, right, Professor? I guess. I'm the stubborn one, then. I'm sorry, Renamon. As long as Miyuki is saved, that's all I care about. Okay, so now we know where the bad guy is, but how do we beat him? He's the ruler of this world. We've got to have a plan. Then let me make a suggestion. Let's focus on rescuing Miyuki before we try to beat anyone. Once we've got her back... Yeah, then what? We run like hell! Like we got somewhere safe... Like we go somewhere safe and use her power to get home. Good plan, Minoru. Sounds perfect. I know, right? It's amazing. For you, better than I would have expected. Come on, can't you just be nice for once? What do you think, Takuma? Personally, it seems pretty realistic to me. It's not bad, but I don't think it'll be that easy. What's that supposed to mean? Yeah, Takuma, what do you mean, not that easy? I mean, I assume if we don't take care of the Master, he is just going to keep causing problems forever. Can't really explain it, but this world and ours seem to be seem to affect each other. As long as something's wrong in this world, our world will be off too. Right, so just running away won't solve the problem. I guess we gotta fight this master after all. 
even though it might be impossible to win. Now hold on, it may not be necessary to defeat him. Huh? Perhaps restoring the world and defeating the master should be viewed separately. What's that mean? But we can't save the world without defeating the master, right? Not necessarily. You mean we don't have to beat the master to save the world? Do you have some special insight about how to save the world then? I'm not exactly sure how, but I think we should explore other solutions as well. But if we don't know how, then all we can do is fight, right? Yeah, right now that's the only choice we have. Is there really another way without fighting? Since our worlds are connected, it seems like we have to beat the Master. Maybe we should focus on saving Miyuki and getting home, like Minoru said. Once we're back in our world, we can rethink how to defeat the Master. But if there's really another way, like the Professor says, we should look into it. In the end, I think we should prioritize res- We should prioritize- uh, In the end, we should prioritize fucking rescuing Miyuki. That's our number one. Like Minoru said, rescuing Miyuki comes first. But just rescuing her won't save the world. That's not what I said. I said first and foremost is rescuing Miyuki. Yeah, just like you said, Takuma. I know, but I just think we should focus on saving her before we make a move. But what about the Master? Isn't the Master's goal to get revenge on our world? On your world? So if you just ignore him, then what? Sounds bad. I didn't say any of this! I said first! God! I know, I agree, we have to def we have to beat the master. And I want to figure out how just after we get back to- That's not- okay. This isn't what I said at all. Yep, no, 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 no. I didn't say anything about doing it after we left. I... God damn it. We don't have the luxury of time here. If we take too long... Wait, there might be some sense to what Takuma is saying. There isn't, because it's not what I said. Fuck you. All we've been doing is fending off the Master's attacks. If we could go back and prepare the f for the fight first, then maybe we could actually win. And what happens to us? Do we go to the other world with you, or will we... Don't say it. Oi doesn't want to think about it, and neither do I. No one knows what'll happen. Agumon and Piedmon were there when we went back before, though. But that doesn't mean they always will be. And even if they come with us, then what? But we can't do nothing, that's for sure. Anyway, let's head to the shrine. That's the only choice we've got, in my opinion. Yeah, whether we beat Master or not, either way we'll need her power. In other words, we have to rescue her if we want to get home. Yes, but that's not why we're rescuing her. I want to rescue her regardless of her power. But if we go to the shrine, we might end up fighting the Master, right? Everyone's faces just got really intense. No matter how prepared we are, the idea of facing the Master is still scary. I'd be lying to say I'm not scared too. Hey, Takuma, everyone seems kind of on edge. Yeah, they do. Perhaps before heading to the shrine, we should check in with everyone? This seems like a final little check-in so that we can maybe get one or two mega evolutions. Which isn't going to happen. Check in with everyone, huh? Yeah, maybe so. It'd be dangerous to go near the master if we were uneasy or anxious. And that's putting it lightly. We probably could use a moment to get our emotions under control. We can't just rush forward immediately because that's what we decided. Each person needs to really be on board with this or we'll never win. I think it's like the professor in Renamon said. We should deal with our emotions before heading to the shrine. We can gather back here afterwards. Free action. Alright everybody, fucking take your pills. Four movements, Jesus Christ! One, two, 
three, four, to fucking Christ. Okay. Am I not allowed to do anything with Kaido? That's not a good sign. Kaido, where the fuck are you? Oh, he's, he's in the spider lily forest. Who should we focus on, though? Aoi, I guess? Minoru and Miu. And maybe Saki, too. We'll see what we can do. Kaido, we're not going to get anything out of, so... We'll just do what we can. Alright, Aoi, what's up? What's up, baby? Is that Aoi? She's getting ready for the final battle. I should talk to her. Aguma! Oh, hey, Labramon, what are you doing here? Takuma. Oh, nothing. I was just thinking back over everything that's happened. You always prepared the meals for us. It's no surprise you're comfortable in the cafeteria. Yeah, you're probably right. Still, that's not all I was thinking of. How so? What really stuck with me was the time I was captured by Dokugamon. Wait, really? That's not exactly something I'd want to remember. Yeah, even so, it linked to an important memory of mine. The time that Labramon fought so desperately to protect me. Of course, you were already super important to me back then. Thanks, Labramon. I was so happy when you did that. When I saw you coming to rescue me, I felt this warmth I'd never known before. It felt so, t it felt so strange, like a gentle feeling spreading through my chest. I felt the same way, Aoi. I could already tell how special you were. Yeah, that was the moment I felt our bond. You know what I mean, don't you, Takuma? Yeah, more than you realize. I'm sure everyone here knows exactly what you mean. Of course, I get it too. Me and Takuma have that kind of bond. Yeah, I think you're right. Labramon and me, Takuma and Agumon, it's not just us. Minoru, Saki, Kaito, Miu... All of us are connected by these kinds of bonds. The fact that I've come to think this way is definitely thanks to you, Takuma. What, me? Yeah, no matter what, you've always supported and encouraged us. No, that's... It's kind of embarrassing to hear her talk like that, but I'm glad too. When I think of how Aoi co Aoi's come to feel about our bond, I can't help but think it's because she's the one who helped build our relationships. And besides, we were saved by Aoi on countless occasions. So hearing her talk like this, I feel like I need to say something too. How should I respond to Aoi? The feeling is mutual. I should be grateful. What the fuck is this option here? Ugh. I feel like I should be grateful is more like saying, Ah, oh, nah, fuck whatever you're saying. What I have to say is actually what matters. So I feel like saying, Oh yeah, it's the same for both of us. Oh, fucking, uh I'm as grateful as you are to me, so the feeling is mutual, are we? I'm sure everyone else feels the same way. Everyone else? Yeah, you do the things I can't, and we help you with things that are hard for you. And that way, all of us grew together, I'm sure of it. Me, you, everyone, even Agumon and the others. I think so too. Yeah, exactly. So everyone supported each other together and grew. I see, that makes sense. Thanks, Takuma. I knew I could... Let me guess, it was only four? Yeah, the, the, these don't really ever seem worth it. I think last chapter we only got four affinity on, what was it, like, Minoru and Miu. So I was like, I don't think we're going to hit 70 before the end of the game, but we'll fucking see. I know we can rely on you. Talking with you has cleared a bit of the fog from my head. Now I can go to save Miyuki without any hesitation. Oh yeah? Glad to hear it. Yes, I'll head back where everyone else is in a bit. Please, wait until then. Okay. God damn it. 
All right, fucking hey, Minora, what are you doing out here, buddy? Buddy boy. There's Minoru. We've got the final battle coming up. Maybe we should talk beforehand. I'm the, Like, the way they're building this up, like, is Chapter 11 the ending for the normal routes? Because fucking How Long to Beat said there was 12 chapters. But maybe that's only 12 chapters in the true ending. We'll fucking see. Get the final battle coming, blah, 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 blah. Hey, Minoru, baby. More to the right. No, the other right. Like this? Monaro Falcomon, what are you- what the heck are you doing? Oh, this? Just taking pictures with my phone. Pictures? Yeah, it's like, something to remember this time by. Might- might our last chance. I feel like that's supposed to say might be our last chance, after all. Our last chance, right, I get it. If we rescue Miyuki and head back to our world, we'll have to say goodbye. Why would we have to do that? We've already established that our Digimon can go with us. Huh, feels kind of sad. I wonder why. Minoru? Oh, it's just... It's been a roller coaster since we came to this world. I was scared half to death when we got to this place. And when I think of leaving it... I know what you mean. The school has been our home base. Our home base. Yeah, it really has! I remember your feelings toward this place being less generous at first, my boy. Well, what do you expect? Thrown into this world out of nowhere, face to face with all this craziness. I was panicked. You thought me to be an adversary upon our first meeting. Uh, how many times do I gotta apologize for that? Oh, just a joke, my boy. I promise my concern has been- has long been put to rest. You've grown leaps and bounds, as has my faith in our bond. Ah, jeez, man, coming out of nowhere with that. Minoru's blushing, but Falcomon's right on the money. Minoru's become a person I can count on any time. More than anything, he's braver and more gung-ho than before. No need to worry about him. Still, I should say something before we fight the Master. What should I say to Minoru? I'm counting on you. I'm... Counting on you too, Minoru. Whoa, where'd that come from, Takuma? Don't tease me, man! I'm not, I really think so. At first you were scared and suspicious of things, but you pulled yourself together. Now you'll fight to the death for your friends. You're like a hero, Minoru. Yeah, you're super cool, Minoru! That was, uh... fucking four? Ugh... <sighs> yeah. You talk like that, what's a guy supposed to do but live up to your expectations? I mean, now's not the time to freak out, right? Enough of that. We should just save Miyuki. That's all there is to it. And save her we shall. Yeah, we'll definitely see it through. Uh, uh, what the fuck is that? Hold on. There's a spooky something sitting here. This fucking rib party going on over here. Alright, uh... Everybody but Kaido, I guess. Oh, there's Mew. Things are about to get dicey. I should talk to her first. Ah, Takuma. What are you doing in the gym, Mew? I just wanted to take a look. Did you guys really go through such a terrible time in here? You mean the fight we had against Dokugamon? That's it, yeah. In that case, yeah, it was bad. My friends got caught in Dokuga Dokugamon's webs. We were in big trouble. But we were saved thanks to Agumon and the others. I see. I had no idea. Miu. I was so sick of Kaido's overprotectiveness when I came here, you know? I didn't listen to a word you guys said, and ran off to the amusement park on my own. They went and made her their queen. Ha, <laughs> typical Miu. Hey, don't act like it was my idea. I didn't see you complaining. Uh, I really regret what I did back then, I swear. It's just, I was off playing around and you guys had to deal with this. Thinking about it fills me with shame, like, maybe I'm a bad kid or something. 
Miyu understands just how dangerous this world is now. She didn't get it at all when she first got here. Maybe things would have been different if she'd been with us from the get-go? Still, that would have exposed her to way more than she's already been through. Besides, I don't think she... I don't think her getting to know all the kids from the park was a bad thing. When I think of that, it's hard to say what would have been the best course of action. What can I say to cheer up Miu? I'm glad you went there. I'm glad you missed this. I'm glad you went there. Thinking back to the park, I'm sure you have mixed feelings about the whole thing. Even so, I think it was a really good experience for you, Miu. You do? Yeah, seeing all those fucking Palmon and Patamon and Beomon all dying. I think that was a great experience. But, but I treated everyone like servants and I let my ego run the show, didn't I? Still, everyone adored you, didn't they? Goes to show how much they wanted to be with you. Patamon and the others just loved you, Miu. Anyone could tell. You really, you really think so? Yeah, they're right. This is my Miu we're talking about. How could they not? If they didn't adore you, they wouldn't call you their queen. You mean, I wasn't just a pain to everyone? If you were, Gigi Mon would have expelled you a long time ago. Besides, it's not like you didn't save the kids from the amusement park. You should have more confidence in yourself. <laughs> Thank you, Takuma. I'll stop thinking myself in circles. Let's take a look. Yep, alright. Ugh. Yeah, it's just like you say, Takuma. So what? Basically, for like a mega evolution, I need to have every correct answer ever, it seems? Unless Affinity carries over to the next playthrough, which I don't think it does. I'll do whatever I can and give it all I've got doing it. And that means saving Miyuki first. I'll give it my all too! We'll do it together, right, Takuma? You got it. Together. Well, let's go talk to fucking Saki because we're not getting anywhere with Kaido. I see Saki over there. What's she doing? Looking at this thing in the- Oh, there's not a thing in the corner for once! That's crazy! Hey, get in there. Get in here, Florimon. I don't get it, but if you say so, like this? No, you're out of frame. Get closer or you'll get cut off. How about I take it? I'll help too! Oh, thanks guys, but I got this. A selfie gives more of that... A selfie gives more of that day in the life vibe. Kind of fun, right? Day in the life? That's what I said. But this is... I know, this isn't even the world we know. Our time here's been as far from normal as it can get, still. This place is normal for Florimon and the others, and we're with them, right? So it's like having Florimon around is the new normal for me. Man, this is hard to explain. Sure, but I think I get what you're trying to say, Saki. Yeah, this is our day in the life! <laughs> I'm so glad to have Saki as a part of my life. Saki's gotten tougher somehow. I got the impression she was a bit of a space case when we first got here. But now she's become such a great partner to Aoi. She said her sick body makes her tire easily, but she seems energetic to me. We may be heading back to our world soon, but this one made Saki stronger. I'm glad we came here. Well, sorry, but I'm glad we came here. You know, not so much the, the Ryo and Shuji part, but uh, everything else seems... Uh, there might be a better way to say this, but I'm glad that we came to this world. Takuma, where did that come from? It's just, I was thinking back on our time here. You've gotten so much stronger, Saki. All of us have, I think. You've become the most reliable partner I could ask for, Takuma. Hey, Saki's no slouch here. She's the best partner ever, you hear me? Even the fact that these guys can talk about us like this is all thanks to this world. That's what I think, so I'm happy we came here. Yeah, that's true, isn't it? I was so scared and clueless when we got here, I just dragged everybody down. But now I'm glad we came. I wouldn't trade getting to know Florimon for anything. Saki! 
Now then, what do you say we snap a few selfies, a few more selfies before we head to the shrine? This might be our last chance. I want to make memories while we can. Saki. I'll take as many as you want. Heh, <laughs> thanks, Florimon. So hey, you know where we'll be headed? You know where we'll be until we all meet up. Right, got it. See you later. Alright, off to the final battle, quotation marks. Hey, Takuma, I'd really like a photograph of us. A photograph? You mean you want to take a picture? When we were together earlier, Minoru, Saki, and the others took a photograph, right? Once I saw that, I really wanted to capture a memory of us together. A memory of us together does sound nice. I wouldn't mind having a photograph, but where? Downloaded Borderlands. Sounds good. Should we take it here in the classroom? Hmm. I guess we don't have to take it here if you don't want to. But this is where we've slept and talked and everything, so... So I think right here would be perfect. Bleh, perfect. Okay, then come over here and let's take it. Oh, we're gonna fucking take a picture with our big dumb dinosaur. Let me just change it to selfie mode. Hey, can you move a can you move a little over that way? How about this? Kiss, 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 kiss. K kiss the little orange dinosaur. Do it, do it. Just when we play. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, cheese! Ah, oh, there's this little dinosaur. Did you take it? Yeah, see, look! Wow, it looks just like us! Amazing! That's what photos are for, ha ha ha. I'm so happy. Now it feels like I can be at your side forever. I wonder if Agumon is worried that we might get separated. That must be why we want- that must be why he wanted the photo. Are we gonna have a whole goddamn, uh, end of Digimon adventure scene? Where we're waving goodbye to our Digimon as we fly off into the sky? And then Mimi's hat's gonna go flying? And we're all gonna cry because Butterfly's a great song? Hey Takuma, have you enjoyed your- have you enjoyed our time together? Huh? Why do you ask that all of a sudden? Come on, just give me an answer. If he means whether I've enjoyed myself, the answer is pretty obvious. Enjoying isn't the right way to put it, though. It's just natural at this point. Would he freak out if I said I wasn't sure? What should I say to Agumon? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, fuck it. Yes, I love you, my little orange dinosaur. Of course I've enjoyed it. You've helped me so much. How can I put this? You make me feel calm, like there's another me around. I feel the same! I thought so as soon as I first felt our bond! Speaking of which, the first time we met you said you've been waiting for me. Yeah, I'd been waiting and waiting. But how did you know it was me you were waiting for? I can't really explain it, but... But he moment, I saw you, I feel like that's supposed to say, but the moment. But the moment I saw you, I just knew. So it just hit you, like some kind of psychic message? Like our hearts or souls are connected somehow? A uh, psy what? Anyway, our souls are being connected sounds about right. All I can say is, the moment I laid eyes on you, I thought, it's him, he's the one! Looking back, I think I felt our souls were connected, too. The second I saw Agumon, I felt something stir deep inside of me. I wonder if Minoru, Aoi, and the others feel the same way. Uh, I don't think Shuji felt that way. I don't think Ryo felt that way. It's probably why they died. It's all pretty strange. Maybe it really was fate that brought us all together. Uh, Takuma, you look kind of zoned out. Oh, uh, it, it's nothing. Anyway, how about we take another picture somewhere else while we're at it? Oh yeah, I'd love to take more photographs with you. Okay, let's look outside the school and try to get more of it on film. I wonder if everybody is gonna be like, fucking, we've been waiting for you, Takuma. 
Here might be a good spot. Oh, are we going to take a group photo? Totally. If we line up like this, we'll all fit. Huh? What are Minoru and the others doing? They're facing the school and holding up their phones. Wait, they must be trying to take pictures too. And then Kaido's just off somewhere else. Really? Let's join them. Hey, Minoru, Saki, let me take Ta- Let me and Takuma join in. Look, it's Takuma and Agumon. Perfect timing. I was just saying someone should go find you two. To find us? Yeah, we thought it'd be perfect time for a group shot. But what, what about Kaido? Minoru's been all worked up about it. He's set on taking a nice group photo. Sounds good to me. Taking pictures is fun. Being able to capture a memory with Aoi makes me happy too. Actually, me and Agumon came to take pictures too. <laughs> wow, then it really was perfect timing. Now that Takuma and Agumon are here, that leaves... The Professor, Renamon, and Kaido. And Drakmon. What was that about me and Drakmon? And what's the big commotion over here anyway? I heard excited voices. What's going on? Apparently they're thinking of taking some pictures. With the Professor and Renamon, that means we're all here. Alright, let's get lined up. Ah, oh, so you want to take a photo of everyone to remember this moment. Uh, yeah, you and Renamon should join too. But not everyone can be in the picture. I'll take the photo so everyone else can be together. Okay, but... It's fine. Having a photo of you all will make me happy too. I'll join the photo in Haru's place. It's not the same, but I'll stand in for him. Thanks, Renamon. Alright, line up everyone. Looking good. Could everyone get a little closer, please? That's it. Alright, and here we go. Wait! What is it, Miu? Over there. there. There's something at the gate. What do you mean, something? An enemy? Crap, this can't be happening. No, not an enemy, it's... Garurumon. The fuck? Uh, oh. Why is he shaking like that? Don't tell me he's injured. Garurumon, injured? What the hell happened? Garurumon! Don't get too close, Professor. It's dangerous. I don't think so. No. Even if Gurumon holds a grudge against me, I can't just abandon him. It's you. Are you okay, Gurumon? Who did this to you? I got into some trouble, but more importantly, it isn't safe here. You need to run fast. Not safe? What do you mean? Survivors from Piedmon's group are after me. Lots of them. Piedmon is also still alive. Your injuries look very painful. I bet he was fighting Piedmon's followers and went a little too far. Huh? Is that you, Renamon? Didn't think you'd be in that form. Still hiding it from them? No, they know my true name and form. Huh, so you made amends with the human children. Yes, to get Miyuki back. But enough about me, let's talk about you. Were you fighting the enemy to protect us, Gururumon? <laughs> ha! Far from it! <laughs> far from it! I simply couldn't abide by their way of doing things, that's all. Uh, can we save the details for later, please? Yeah, we need to focus on those wounds first. <laughs> It's just a scrape, huh. And we don't have time to spare. I'll be fine. You need to get a move on. But, but... I'm fine, now hurry! Okay, time to evacuate the area. Alright, Takuma. Wait, we need to take Garurumon with us! We can't leave him here! Ah, uh, silly children. That's just how they are, nonetheless. I'm not willing to abandon you either, as I said before. You did say that. Alright, Gurumon, hang on tight. 
Hold it right there! Uh, looks like I wasn't fast enough. Oh, it's fucking pu it's it's goddamn Puppet Mon! A whole bunch of them! You're always too slow, Garurumon. Of course I caught up with you. Ha 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 ha! What are you doing here? This must be part of Piedmon's gang that Garurumon mentioned. Looks like it. Oh yeah, it, it's a little weird that Garurumon would be fighting a bunch of mega level Digimon. At least I think they're mega levels. I only came for the trader, but I get all these kitties to sacrifice too. What luck! I can barely contain my joy. Killing them won't solve anything. You should listen to Garurumon if you know what's good for you. Okay, so it is Puppetmon. It's it, they're not gonna, they're not gonna change it back to its Japanese name of uh, Pinocchiomon. Shut up! It's their fault. Piedmon's dead. He's not dead. All humans do is bring destruction to our world. That's not true. How many times do I have to explain? It was the fog at the altar that swallowed up Piedmon. They did nothing. Yeah, the fog came for us too, after all. The master won't save you from the fog. Shut up! Just shut up! It's not too late, Garurumon. We can still offer the humans as a sacrifice. You think I'd do that? Never. Have it your way, then. I'll sacrifice you, then. Human-loving traitor. Okay. We'll just fight a bunch of Puppetmon. That's fine. Oh, is he? Oh, yeah, okay, he's gonna hit, uh, Weregurumon again. He already did this. It's not a big shock. He put pants on. Made him stronger. That's how that works. Uh, okay, so what do we got? We got a goddamn Hercules Kabuterimon. That's a mega evolution right there. Uh, Edamon. Uh, there's there's Puppetmon and Mega. Fucking Daramon and Ultimate. Fucking Christ. Grand Kuwagamon. So a whole bunch of Ultimate levels and Mega evolutions. So this is gonna be a fucking fight. Jesus Christ. Alright, uh, fucking Falcomon, I guess. Uh, Renamon can go Mega, so we'll send her over there. She needs to level up too. I, I guess it's a he. I don't know why I keep calling it her. And uh, mm. yeah, I guess. I guess this will do. Puppetmon defeated. Where Garurumon dies. Oh, so we, we don't have to actually fight the other Mega Digimon. We just have to defeat Puppetmon. Oh, shit! Are we gonna get, uh, Metal Garurumon? Having trouble moving with those injuries? Ah, ha, ha, serves you right. Uh, you know, you really shouldn't be fighting in your shape. Might hurt yourself. Ha, 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 Stop. Stop it! What is it, human? You want to die? Stay back, you'll never stand a chance against one of us. No, you're too important to me. I have to do this. I might sleep soon anyways. Yep, that's fine. You're tired, you should get some sleep. I'm important to you? I've been tired from last night. I imagine. You were up real late last night, it seems. Jesus Christ! What's this nonsense? Anyone in my way will be destroyed. Didn't sleep kind of anything. That's kind of what it seemed like. Oh, okay, he didn't- he didn't digivolve. I really thought he was going to. Huh. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, here comes a bunch of ultimates and megas just coming to fucking beat up these uh, poor rookie levels. Alright, uh, it's fucking... 
What do I got for moves? Wolf Claw? I got, I got nothing. I got literally nothing. I can beat up this chest, I hope. Wolf Claw! Alright, here comes the Edamon! Alright, so... Again, our normal strategy, just boost up War Greymon. He'll solve all of our problems. Alright, so... We only have to defeat Puppetmon. Everybody else here is just whatever. So let's go far away from those guys. Let's talk to Agumon, boost him up. And then Digivolve to War Greymon. Let's see if we can't fucking pelt somebody with a Terra Force right now. Hey, maybe we could hit fucking Puppetmon from here. Give him a bad time. Shit. Wait. Ah, oh, goddammit. Come on. Come on, we can do it. We can fucking peg him from here. If we throw it hard enough. Ah, oh, it's bullshit. Alright, Terra Force! We can at least distract Puppetmon. He can attack Blossommon on his turn, which will cause him to not defend. Which should give us a chance to fucking plow him with a, a goddamn... Terra Force. Yeah, now let's take care of this guy first. Alright. Who's going first? War Greymon? Ah, oh, you shouldn't have. Ah, oh, you shouldn't have. We can do big damage to Puppetmon, holy shit. Ah, oh, he's fucked. Damn it, my body isn't moving the way it should. Do it, pussy! Wear Garurumon! You, wow. <laughs> Go ahead and laugh if you want. No, I would never laugh at you! I'd never do such a thing! It has always pained me, you know. Leaving this world without you, I always regretted it. I wouldn't blame you if you hated me for it. And yet, you heard me out at the altar, and you fought for me. That's why, this time, I refuse to leave your side. I'll be here with you always, no matter what happens. Wait a minute. Aki... Haru? Yes, Wergurumon? I always thought it might be you, but I was afraid to accept it. Your face has changed, but you're the same old Aki Haru, aren't you? Yes, it's me! It's me, Akiharu! You finally came back. I'm sorry it took me so long. Forgive me. So you didn't just abandon me. No, I would never do that to you! Now I'm prepared to fight with you till the very end. Thank you, Akiharu. What the heck are you two babbling about? Just die already! Well, I don't know about... Uh, what the... Uh, I remember now. My bond with Akiharu. It makes me stronger! Your bond? What? Someone who doesn't trust humans could never understand. 
Just knowing Akiharu is at my side sends fire surging through my body. Nothing can hold me back when I'm fighting with Akiharu. Oh, he's gonna do it! Here comes Metal Garurumon, baby! Where Garurumon? Thank you, Akiharu. You gave me the strength to keep fighting. Where Garurumon? Digivolve to... Fucking do it! We're, like, one step away from getting a fucking, uh, Omnimon at this point. Ah, there he is! There's the big dumb robot dog! With his weird tail. Full Metal Partner. Hey, that- <laughs> Is that a fucking Full Metal Alchemist reference? Wow! Wow! Metal Garurumon! So I imagine he's uh, the same as uh, the other Megas we have, where he has an area of effect. Attack. That's ah, fine, no, just to hit her. Pop it, Pommel! Oh my god! Oh god! Apparently he's real fucking slow though, because he's way at the end there. The fucking Puppetmon's gonna be dead by the time... Yeah, no, he's... He's dead before we could even do anything with uh, Metal Gurumon. God damn it. How dare you attempt to resist me! Fine, I'll let you have the win this time! Oh. Wait! Stop, Metal Gururumon. Any more fighting in your state will be suicide. I guess you're right, Akiharu. I am feeling just a little bit tired. I was gonna say, are we gonna watch Metal Gururumon murder Puppetmon again? Because that's how it went in uh, Digimon Adventure. Puppetmon just got fucking burned to death by uh, Metal Gururumon and Matt while he was being edgy. Sorry you had to fight so hard on my behalf. We're all safe now because of you. Thank you so much. What are you talking about? Of course I protected you. I'm the one who made you go too far. You put your body in harm's way. Are you okay, Akiharu? Are you injured? Oh, no, I'm fine. Not a single injury. Thanks to you. I see. That's good. Hush now. It's time for you to rest. Sorry to be a burden, but maybe you're right. Now how about that group photo? <laughs> Thank you, and welcome back, Metal Gururumon. So now if we check the profile screen, it should have Gururumon on there now? Should? Oh, he went back to Kabumon! Oh, good! Oh, he's not on here. Weird. Fucking weird. Uh, fucking what am I looking for here? Yeah, that's a Gabumon. I guess it would have been just too weird to have a, a goddamn champion level Digimon all the time. Ugh. Hey, look, looks like Gabumon's up and at him. Gabumon, how are you feeling? What happened? I... You were worn out after fighting with Puppetmon and fell asleep. Are you okay? Does anything hurt? No, I feel fine. I'm sorry about all that, Gabumon. It's okay, Akiharu. More importantly, are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. Totally fine. That's a relief. Wait. Are you crying? My apologies, it's just that after seeing you again, I... It's been 50 years since I last saw you, Gabumon. Makes me emotional. Wait a minute, when did I change back into this form? 
As soon as you fell asleep, I was kind of surprised. The professor said this is how you looked the last time you were together. You should have seen it. As soon as you changed, he started crying. And he's still crying now. I shouldn't behave like this at my age. I'm so sorry. Humans these days. Try to keep it together, okay? Ah, uh, right. Oh, I think it's kind of sweet. They haven't seen each other in decades. Yeah, there must be so many things they want to talk about. Don't feel like you have to hold back because we're here. Now is hardly the time for chatting. We can't get caught up in our emotions. We need to start planning. What do you mean? Those guys are definitely going to be back. We should get going while we can. But if we leave here, where will we go? Is there anywhere we can go? Calm down, Saki. He just wants us to use our time wisely. Uh -huh. What do you mean? We were going to leave eventually, right? So it's just a little ahead of schedule. Right, guys? We have to leave the school and go save Miyuki. We'll fight that master, kick his ass, and then go back to our world. Kaido's words really struck a chord with me. Fight the master, rescue Miyuki, and go home. Looks like it's finally time for us to make our move. Kaido's right. We gotta do it any we gotta do it anyway sooner or later. It's all happening so fast though. Are we even ready? Maybe we should take more maybe we should take more time to prepare. We're emotionally ready, aren't we? That's a good point. We did take time to sort out our feelings. We don't have time for second thoughts. Now this now is the time to save Miyuki. What should we do? I think we're ready. I think we're emotionally ready for this. Let's take this chance to face the master. Okay, sounds like a plan to me. Right, dawdling won't help. Finally, my time has come. No more holding back. Let me ask you again then. Will you lend me your help to save Miyuki? Of course we will, Renamon. Let's ditch this school and head to the shrine. Great, time to hit the ru- Wait! What now, Miyu? Someone else is here? Oh, that's not what you meant. No, I mean for the photo, we still need to take it! Oh, that's true! What's the point of this? It's about capturing a memory. I get what Miyu's saying. It would be sad to leave here without doing anything to commemorate the occasion. I feel the same. This place was like our home. Yeah, we have so many memories here. What's the big deal? You're acting like you'll never come back. I mean, we might not, right? True, you might be leaving us for good soon. Can we please not talk about that right now? I don't want to think about it myself, to be honest. What do you think, Takuma? Will it be farewell when we go back to your world? When you go back to your world? It'll never be farewell, Agumon. We can come back again once everything's settled. Okay, here we go. Everyone in the front of the school. It's really, it's really everyone this time. Don't tell me you want me in the picture too. Of course, it's supposed to commemorate the whole group. Speaking of which, are you okay in that form with the photo instead of Garumon? This feels more natural. It's how I always was with Akiharu, after all. Alright, let's snap that pic. Very well, leave the photo taking to me. But the professor, we want everyone in the picture. Then how do you propose we take the photo? If we use a self-timer, then no one has to take it. Perfecto! Kind of a weird time to be so excited about a silly picture, but whatever. Get over it, Kaido. Don't be a buzzkill. Hey, I'm not saying we shouldn't take it. Alright, everyone line up. It's finally time for our group photo. Woohoo! Another photograph with Takuma! Alright, everyone. Smile nice and wide. We've got to make this look good. Come on, everyone. Move in close. Fine. I'll join if Akiharu wants me to. 
I'll be showing this photo to Miyuki soon enough. All set. Say cheese! You know, this photo would probably be perfect if there was, you know, a Ryo and a Shuji in there. Now that we've captured this memory, let's head to the shrine. Time for the final battle. Stay on your toes, everyone. You never know where Puppet Mon could be hiding. Alright, now let's get going. The time has come to finally settle things. Once and for all. They're really fucking talking like this is it! It might be. Under Shrine. Deep Under Shrine. Let's just fucking check these places first. Look, Takuma, I can see Puppet Mon's group over there! Huh? There they are. Damn, who thought we'd run into them here? Still, it doesn't look like they've noticed us yet, right? In that case, let's just wait around here until they head off. Then, like, we head the long way around to the shrine? I ain't exactly proud of the idea, but we could sneak up and catch them by surprise. What should we do, Takuma? They'll realize if we're here soon. They'll realize we're here soon. We don't have time to mess around. Should we hide before they find us? Take a detour to the shrine now? Or maybe we can hit them with a surprise attack. Yeah, let's fuck it. Let's fuck it. It's all or nothing here. Let's dive in with a surprise attack. Hey, are you serious? That's hardly the best course of action. I second that. If we're gonna throw down, let's hit them straight on. Ah, uh, but if we do that, it'll just turn into a fight like before. If we gotta fight, we gotta fight. Hey, is this really the time for a discussion if we keep talking? You punks made it this far? Shoot, they heard us. Damn, surprise attack's out of the question now. Guess we're doing this. Wait! Oi? Please, would you just hear me out? Who the heck are you? That's too dangerous, Oi. They're not the type that'll listen. But the master's deceiving them. How can we just attack them without saying anything? Deceiving us? Yes, the master's lying to you. He may have told you that sacrificing human children will save this world. But that's a total lie. The master's just using you for his own purposes. Please, just hear us out. There's no reason for us to fight, really. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up! How can I believe the jerks who killed Piedmon? Well, if you're gonna talk nonsense, you'll be the first ones to die. Look out, oi! Time for talk is over. We have no choice, choice, but to fight. Damn, you don't gotta tell me twice. Yeah, Agumon, everyone, here we go. Yeah, that goes without saying. Alright, so this is the same thing that happened with uh, Fangmon, I guess. Where anywhere we go that's not the story place is, uh, we're gonna be fighting a bunch. So that is, uh, unfortunate. Uh, Alright, what do we got? We should take the ones that can Mega Digivolve, I guess. That seems about right. Puppet Mon defeated, all annihilated. Yes, come closer, Puppet Mon. See what fucking happens. Rosemon and an Ice Leomon. See what you fucking get. Puppet man, how about this? How about you just you just take that, just take all of that. And take some of this too. 
Man, having all uh, mega level, uh, mega level Digimon sure is great. You just hit them over and over. All right, and what's status? Abnormalities and stat reductions removed. Huh. Not that we can do that with anybody, but that's a good talk. All right, so what do you got? Freezing breath? Oh, it's... Oh, I can actually still hit him from here. And he's frozen, so fuck him. I literally just walk over to him and uh, fucking tap him. Let's give him a nice little slap on the back. Slap on the ass. Ah. So did we get a, uh, no, I was gonna say, did we get a Mega Evolution card? We did not. Alright, well I guess if we're just gonna fucking fight Puppetmon over and over and over. We'll just go to the deep under shrine. Is our destination truly up ahead? I admit I have my doubts. The path to the lowest level is through here. Yo, this door ain't budging an inch. Uh, uh, weird, again, that he shows up as Garurumon and not Gabumon, now that he's Gabumon. But alright. Everybody's got their Digimon, and even Haru's here with nothing. Hmm, should we break it down? I wouldn't if I were you. The enemy will be upon us in mere moments. Besides, I bet smashing this thing's easier said than done. Huh, you think? After all the weird things we've seen, maybe it's sealed with a special power. She's right, the master's passed here, so a barrier like that makes sense. Then how are we supposed to open it? Some magic words? Or maybe a key? I don't see any hole for a key or anything. How do we get inside, Renamon? In the past, I used to go in with, a, with the master's underlings. Oh, one of them pressed an object t to the door. A Magatama, I think. I see, a Magatama then. It seems that this is the key to the door. How do you know that? Magatamas are beads with mysterious power, used as wards or talismans in ancient times. And we just have to look for this ma magma tummy thing. Fine, but how do we do that? I mean, there was one in the tunnel. If we can find the tunnel. I bet Puppetmon's minions have it. We should look for them. Is there a way we can get them to hand it over? I understand how you feel, Oe, but nothing we can say will change their minds. They hate all of us as much as they hate Gabumon here. But the Master's just tricking Puppetmon, isn't he? Hmm, why don't we see if there's another Magatama around here somewhere? Sorry, I'm afraid that's nigh impossible. I've walked around the shrine many times. Not once did I spot an item to that effect. What? Then what the heck should we do? The Magatama is a must if we're going to open this door. As things stand, stealing it from Puppetmon's crew is our best bet. But the ones we'd be fighting are just being tricked by the Master, like they said. And yet I can't imagine any way we could persuade those guys. Saki mentioned looking for another Magatama. Is that even possible? I highly doubt it. Let's talk to Puppetmon! They may be our enemy, but the fact is that they're also victims of the Master's lies. Why don't we search them out and try to talk to them into handing over the Magatama? There's no chance they'll hear us out. Did you forget the last battle? Gabumon's right. Their blind faith in the Master is unshakable. I doubt we can avoid a fight. Guess there's no choice. We gotta steal it. Man, alright, if you say so. Okay, if we're all done talking, let's track down Puppetmon and the others. They must be lurking around this shrine somewhere. We just gotta find the hidden enemy! We've done that tons of times already! Isn't that right, Takuma? Yeah, I'm counting on you, Agumon. Let's go, guys. Just another fucking fight with Puppetmon, I guess. Inner Shrine! The shrine goes farther in than I first expected. 
Yeah, as far as I know, huh? Renamon, what is it? Shh, I thought I heard something. Shit, next time we meet, I'll make you regret. Hey, that voice. Hey, it's them. Ah, oh, they found us. Damn it, I knew it. What the heck are you guys doing here? What, he says. Ain't it obvious we're gonna going straight to the master? I suppose you were all off licking your wounds, am I correct? How'd you know? We knocked you jerks on your asses with that last fight, huh? Now you've done it. I guess you need another lesson in pain. No, don't tell me they mean to fight us here. No way, but they're still injured from the last battle. You say that, but they ain't looking for peace. More like a piece of us. We should just take the fight to them, right? So it really come it it's really come to this. Uh, take them head on, I guess. For now, let's take them head on. Got it, Takuma. Leave it to me. Looks like you're ready for what's coming. Kenzoku, go get him! Kisha. You'll not defeat us so easily. Yeah, I'd say it's time for payback. <laughs> no, you wouldn't. Uh-huh. He talked some mad game, but they fell apart almost instantly. The previous battle must have taken a real toll. Their injuries likely hadn't healed. Shut up! Wounds like this won't! Ah! Stop it. There's nothing to gain from pushing yourself now. Big talk for a bunch of traitors. You're just here to finish us off anyway, ain't you? Then just get on with it. Instead, how about a deal? A deal? Hand over the Magatama, the one used to open the door to the inner area. We'll leave if you do. Renamon. Our goal is to save Miyuki, after all, so this works, right? Yeah, Renamon's right, so what do you say? Hmm, hate to break it to you, but we don't have the Magatama. Someone else does. What? You ain't pulling our leg, are ya? Don't believe me? Fine, do whatever you want. You'll just be wasting precious time. I don't think he's lying. What should we do? If someone else has it, then of course we have to track them down. Okay, let's go look somewhere else. Okay. It's gonna be a whole thing. You! You're still hanging around here? Perfect timing. We were just trying to sniff out, you morons. Sniff out? For what? The Magatama. Huh? Your face says it all. You have it, don't you? I, I have no clue what you're talking about! It's no use trying to play dumb. You can't fool us. We know that Magatama is needed to open the door into the shrine. We even know you guys have it. So you figured out that much. In that case... No, we'll have to fight again at this rate. They weren't willing to hear us out before. I doubt this time will be any different. Okay then, I'll give it a shot. Minoru, are you sure? If we can get away without a fight, we should at least try, right? I'll see what I can do. Just watch me. Sure, okay. Sup, party people? What do you say enough's enough with the fisticuffs? Ain't nothing for y'all to gain from fighting at this point now, is there? What did you say? I mean, we'll fight, you'll lose, we'll take the Magatama. Sucks to be you, right? So if you just cut to the chase and hand over the stone, we'll... How dare you! This disrespect is completely unforgivable! Yeah, what the heck? He's super pissed! With such incitement... With such incitement, what do you expect? Looks like the plan was a bust. Talk about they're itching for a fight! Talking was pointless from the start. What's the plan? Fine then, if we have another battle on our hands, so be it. Alright, let's take our Puppetmon. Easy. Uh... So we put Gabumon there, Renamon there, and then Falcomon here. If this works the same way as last time, we should be able to just walk on over to Puppetmon again. You fool! <coughs> oh, what a chump. Can't believe you did the same thing again. Uh, 
の番だね So obviously it's what Omnimon after uh, War Greymon there, but I don't know what the other one there is. Like clearly it's not. Well, I, I I don't know what it is. If Omnimon's the other one, I assume that's another mix, Digivolve, which I thought Omni one was the go-to. Omnimon was the go-to. I didn't know Agumon was fusing with uh, other Digimon. Oh, I fucked up. Alright, that's fine. It's War Greymon's turn anyway. Slapped him and his head spun around. Takuma, looky what I found. Here, you take it. Oh, this? It's a Magatama. Oh, thanks, Agumon. Great, now we can go to the inner part of the shrine. Great. Fantastic. Now we can uh, break people's Cyclops. Find out their deep dark secrets. Oh yeah, no, we're just here. No, look, look back at the other wall. Shit, I feel like that was super important. Somebody had a goddamn uh, the virus hand thing. Is this the inner part of the shrine? So does that mean the... Unless that was what Kunemon was before it was Kunemon. Or no, I guess that would be Drachmon. Drachmon probably evolved from that uh, weird eyeball thing. Is this the inner part of the shrine? It's like the other room, but a little different. There are big pictures on this room's walls too. They're called murals. What are they pictures of, though? That's whatever. The great anus in the sky. Uh, looks like the sky, and those are clouds? Alright, so... Takuma's in the top right. I assume that's Kaido next to him. Uh, I guess that's uh, Aoi, third on the right. Uh, is that a fucking weird spider thing? I guess that would be Ryo. Uh, what the fuck is that? Uh, fucking... This is a little weird. Who would have... Yeah, I can't really... I don't... I guess, uh... The one on the left would be, uh... Saki. With the weird plant. Can't remember its name. But who would have, uh... The fucking... Not Palmon now? Uh... Would it be Shuji? Which would mean, uh... That weird dinosaur thing is probably, uh... Miu? And then the bottom one, I guess, would be, uh... Minoru. Yeah, it's weird. I'm probably wrong. And this is a person and a monster? Intriguing. I wonder what all this means. If we consider all the murals together, they may begin to make sense. You mean they're all part of one story? Not necessarily, but they may warrant more time than what we have available. However, I can make a few inferences based on these murals. For example, the gods called 
kimonogami, or their messengers, are connected to humans. Connected? Like how? I don't know, but see how the two murals are connected by a cord? Oh yeah. Perhaps the gods and the humans were closer in ancient times. You mean like me and Kaido? How all of us are? Perhaps. Or perhaps not, who knows. At any rate, people don't see gods and spirits like these as existing anymore. Humans see them as something to believe in, or have faith in, right? Hmm, sounds like how Piedmon and his crew see the master. You mean like a scary entity that can be swallow that can swallow up the world? Yikes! Your gods sound pretty terrifying. Not exactly. You see, people don't think gods have actual bodies in the human world. So it's hard to determine if they're truly good or evil. Quite vague, really. In any case, they're not as immediate as the master in this world. Although, of course, some people have very sincere beliefs in them. Same for us. Some believe in the master and some don't. Right, but in our world, gods are more distant or faint. Like, gods don't physically exist, so they're just kind of out there somewhere. A faint presence... Bleh. A faint presence, as if they don't really exist exactly. In that case, perhaps... What is it, Professor? What's on your mind? I'm sorry, I just got a little lost in thought. Anyway, enough talking for now. We're keeping you-know-who waiting. Well, you took the words right out of my mouth. Now's not the time for lectures. Once I get interested in something, all else disappears from my mind. A bad habit of mine. Whatever, is everyone fully and completely prepared to get moving now? Renamon's eyes are intense. This is really it. Once we head into the inner area, there's no turning back. Everyone's thinking the same thing. If anyone wants to turn back, this is their last chance. But even if we do turn back, nowhere safe the way things are now. In my opinion, our only choice is to go on. Still, if anyone said they wanted to wait here, I wouldn't stop them. How should I respond to Renamon? Ready as ever. We've always been ready, Renamon. Our goal is to rescue Miyuki. We'll stop the Master's plan for revenge, whatever that is, and save the world. There's no looking back. Good, then there's nothing left to say. We're as prepared as we'll ever be. Totally, I'm ready to make the Master cry. Time to get payback for all we've been through. But first, we're rescuing Miyu. No, we're not rescuing Miyu, we're rescuing Miyuki. That's a translation error right there. Alright, Labramon, we get it. Let's just handle that, okay? Nothing will stop us if we work together. Yeah, well said. Okay, we'll do our best to support you. Now then, Renamon, show me to your- Show me to my sister! Got it. Come with me and stay alert. I sense the Master's presence stronger than ever. Are we actually gonna see him for once, or is he still gonna be a weird ball? Oh! Another room? Is this where Miyuki is? No, she's still farther in. Is it just me, or is there something weird about this room? Minoru's right, there's a really strange vibe in here. I hate this feeling, like something heavy is pressing down. Yeah, it feels like we're literally under pressure. Like someone's watching us. Ugh. It's getting hard to breathe. Take it easy, Miu. Lean on me and take deep breaths. Oh. Sorry, Kaido. My heart started. My heart started racing for some reason. Did you hear what I said? Take slow, deep breaths. We're heading into the master's domain now. Let your guard down in your toast. Ah. What is a Takuma? the hell? My phone! I just got a message! Huh? What's going on now? Just this message. Is it another one of those ones where the text's all garbled? Well, parts are still garbled, but I can read more than before. So what? It's probably random. Wait, I got one too! Mine is more legible now too! For real? 
Yeah, like, when you're back and I'm waiting. Just a few parts here and there. What could this mean? Guys, maybe we should move on now. The longer we wait, the more Miyuki is suffering. I want to save her now. Right, sorry. Alright then, this way. Wow, look at this place. I sense something huge lurking around here. Good, I'm ready for it. But this is the first time in my life I've ever felt something so strong. Ah, oh, my legs are starting to shake. You guys are making it worse. It's okay, Miyu. I'm right here. Don't forget that. Thank goes for you, Takuma. I won't leave your side. Got it. Let's keep moving. How how high leveled could the final boss be? 60? Eh. Yuki should be just up ahead. Okay. Yikes! What's going on? A message. Looks like I got one too. Me too, in the text. I can read it more of it now. Come home before it gets dark. Mine says pick up some milk on the... Hey, what am I? What am I, a servant? Mine's the same. It's not impossible to read anymore. I'm getting messages too, but why, I wonder? I have no idea. Me either. I wonder what's really going on here. Messages that are easier to read, and for everyone all at once. It's almost like we're in some sort of digital world. Could it really just be by chance? Or is it because something's happening in this world? That would be- that would be important. Maybe I should see what happens if I try sending a message of my own. But we've almost reached Miyuki now, and we're nearly out of time. Come on guys, what now? How many times do I have to keep saying this? I mean, you can walk and text at the same time. Renamon is getting desperate. Send a test. Yeah, no, send a test message. Just fucking easy. Just write bots and send it. Who says I can't walk and send a message at the same time? Sorry, Renamon. Let's keep moving. Finally. And here we go. A test message to myself. I got it. It worked. And the text is mostly fine. So maybe messages to our world would make it too? Might as well give it a try. Takuma, why did you stop again? Sorry, it's it, just a sec. Texting while walking is harder than I thought. I'll do it later. Are you okay, Takuma? You seem concerned about those messages. Yeah, well, we don't really have time to think about it right now, so... I can't disagree with that. However, maybe there's a more simple reason for the lack of garbled text. A simple reason? Messages might be more legible because we are in the Inner Shrine. In other words, we are closer to our world in the Inner Shrine. Huh? What do you mean? We, we already explained this! You have your two fucking circles and then the area in the middle between the circles is the, uh, the Inner Shrine. So we're the closest between both. Miyuki's up ahead, everyone. Get ready. Looks like we're out of time. Let's focus on helping my sister. Right. Well, you know, it's Miyuki. Wow, the area deepest inside the shrine. Takuma, look! It's Miyuki. Renamon, everyone, look! Miyuki's over there! Miyuki. Miyuki! Are we safe here? What a what about what's his face? We're here to rescue you, Miyuki. You're safe now. So you think you're going to take back my little priestess? Idiots. Uh We're too late. The master has taken over her mind. Miyuki, sis, pull yourself together. You aren't the type to let the master win. Don't be silly. My little priestess's mind has already been completely overwritten. You'll never see your friend again. Ah, why? What's going on? She's in pain all of a sudden. This happened before, right? She was still in there. She was still in there somewhere. So it's the same thing again. Miyuki. I, I mean, sis, it's me, Haru. We can finally be together again. I'm begging you, please listen. Who is calling me? That voice. 
Oh, uh, why? Her mind should have been destroyed by my darkness! Miyuki, don't let the master take control. Miyuki! I... I... No, she is my doll, my priestess! You can't have her! Assemble my loyal followers! Yikes, where'd these guys come from? Damn, there's a lot of them! But retreat is not an option. Wait, something seems off! Takuma, they're surrounding Miyuki! Hey, what are you doing to her? I need a stronger body to serve as my vessel. What? No! Give me your strength. Merge with the body of my priestess! Kisha! What's happening? This can't be. They're fusing into her body! No! Stop it! Stop it! Get away from her! Oh! Oh! What the fuck? That's normal! Oh, so much power! Yes! No, not my sister! His followers have taken over her body. This is insanity! Ah, oh, thank you so much for getting in my way! Now I will take all of your stupid little lives. Look out, Takuma! Ah, oh, we don't have time to figure out what's going on. Time to fight back, Agumon! So are we just fighting that, or are we fighting a whole bunch? We're just fighting that, okay. And it's, uh, level 55. It's a super ultimate. Not quite a mega, just a super ultimate. Not sure what that means. So we'll take fuck it. Oh, wait, is there, there a whole bunch back here? Not really. I bet they're going to keep spawning back here if we don't take out the, uh, Miyuki. Uh So the same as always, Miyuki defeated. Agumon, Gabumon, or Renamon dies. Okay, so we gotta watch out then. If any of those three die, I guess we lose. Alright, Agumon, you know how this works. Grab these. They better be good, considering they're technically in the last area. Oh good, more! More. Uh, let's boost your physical attack, which isn't going to affect Terra Force, I guess. I think we're just, yeah, we're just out of range. Alright, so my Otismon's just gonna sit here and just take it all. No, not Gabumon! No! Shit, alright, well. Gabumon, or, uh, War Greymon's not gonna be as strong as he should be. Alright. Take this, my love, my anger, and all of my sorrow. Holy shit. 50% accuracy. Jesus. I guess that's going to be the uh, gimmick for this, is it's going to be really hard to fucking hit them. <laughs> oh. Whatever, we got three Megas. Which we, like, had to get because Gabumon and Renamon 
hit Mega through story reasons. So it's like, no matter what, we would have came into here with three Megas. So I can't just say it's going to be a goddamn cakewalk. one and then defend all right show me what you got shade that's nothing that's nothing you know what I should probably just move everybody back who cares if like these enemies are coming forward Like, the more people that can attack, uh, Miyuki, the better. Ow. Not what I wanted. It's fine. Oh! Oh! That's fine, probably. Let's talk to War Greymon, get that debuff off. Hmm. God damn it, this is another thing where it's like they're not super strong, but they just have a, a shitload of goddamn uh, HP. For no reason other than to be annoying. God damn. Uh, what are my options here? Because I'm a mega, I can, uh,. Move twice, I guess. Ow. It's gonna be a problem if, uh... I keep getting debuffed. Confusion? Oh! That's no good. Here, let's fucking get that off of there right now. So we'll just keep hitting uh, Miyuki. Ah, we'll just keep trying to hit Miyuki, I guess. Speed break. No! Thing we've been stocking up on big band-aids, baby! This fucking accuracy shit is gonna be a, a whole thing, isn't it? Alright, well, that's the end of that. Okay, well... I see we can't rush through this fight. Hmm. Mm-mm-mm. We have to be very careful. Take out everybody.
Just leave her up there. We'll uh, see if enemies just keep spawning. Which it'll be a pain if they do, but there's not a lot we can do. Let's see, are these guys also like super jacked? Oh, not really. These guys are pretty normal. So maybe it won't be so bad. Except when they dodge like that. Show me what you've got! Yeah, that's fine. much time this is gonna waste but we'll just fucking keep uh slamming these guys back here we'll see whether or not this was a good use of time or not they are really fucking defending Hopefully freezing them will not do anything, apparently. That's fine. Should be our turn first, right? Yeah, it will. Alright, cool. Yeah, eat a dick. Alright, so now we'll just slowly take our way all the way up there. Once we take out these chests, though, others are going to spawn. We know that. So we'll make sure to take those guys out real quick because they also have a stupid amount of HP. Which sucks, but what can you do? Okay. I guess that's because this is what, turn three? They're just spawning more in. So based on what turn it is, more enemies just keep popping in. Yes, no, move closer. See what happens. See what you fucking get. Okay. I don't think they'll be able to reach me here. I'm not gonna play it too loose.
Yeah, okay, there's the other frog. There's the other froggy. Oh, baby, that's not a lot. Yes, yes, come here. Come here. Hold my hand. Slap my ass. Uh, rib party set. Fucking boost everybody up. Everybody gets SP, baby! Seems like a good distance. Now we can really see how much damage we can fucking. If we, you know, manage to hit. Emerald block. been saving all of our meat for so we can just keep giving everybody SP. Oh, they unfroze. I don't know if that's going to be unfortunate. Alright, boost seed. Let's get that knockoff there. Gotta really watch out for Garurumon, I guess. Okay, so they don't seem to be respawning more. But that could just be the turn. We don't know yet, so we're not going to uh, make any terrible assumptions. Uh... <laughs> Hold on here. Burr, burr, burr. What's going on? There we go. Keep that thing frozen. Come on, see what happens. See what happens. Oh. 
Okay, another frog. Cool. Cool. As long as everybody hangs out next to each other, we have infinite uh, SP, apparently. That's good. Except for where Garumon over here. We need this choice rib. You know what? No, he's not. He's going to move. Well, okay. No, he's going to move over here. And he's going to move over here. That way everybody can uh, get that uh, SP area thing. This rib party set for everybody and their friends. Motherfucker back there can just stay frozen forever, I guess. No, oh, no, come on, come on, come over here. Come over here, you. I don't think you can stay out of this. We'll be over there in a second to talk to your manager. Okay, so they're they're just gonna keep spawning not like big frogs, which is the important thing, but frogs nonetheless. Oh hey Miyuki's coming! Oh no! Alright, well I was gone. Cool. Fantastic. Guy's still frozen over there. Probably will be forever, which is good. I don't think uh, Miyuki can hit War or uh, Metal Groom on first, but I guess it's still best to just be wary. Oh yeah, he's fucking running. He knows what's up. He knows. He knows his days are numbered. How many people can be frozen at once? Okay, well that doesn't seem to be... Doesn't seem to be able to go up ledges, which is fucking great, I guess. Which is unfortunate. Somebody's gonna get hit up there. Oh, unless they want to start fucking healing! Swell! Oh, 
get over here, you. Or not. Jesus Christ. Alright. They don't want to get too close. Again, it kind of sucks that I can't uh, see its range, because that would definitely help. Not that the game is that hard to begin with, it seems. Terra Force! Need to get rid of that motherfucker up there. God damn it! Where's that other fucking puppet? There he is. I'm no block. Ah! Wow! Holy fuck! Stop. Just fucking stop. Why? Boost up War Greymon here and see what happens. All right, good. Fuckers frozen. Also, we gotta take that guy out. He is... Hitting real hard! While also staying out of uh, Miyuki's range there. Oh, come on! Christ. Oh, more frogs. My favorite. Terra Force. Oh, yeah. We're getting a cutscene now. <laughs> you monsters are all bark and no bite. I'm sorry, Takuma. I I think I Agumon! I never thought I'd see Agumon like this. We can't let this go on. I tire of this fight. Time to put a stop to it once and for all. Yuki. Let go of me, Yuki! Let go of my sister! That voice. No! Stop it already, sis! My body. Why? Miyuki, she stopped moving! I made it back to you at long last. Sorry it took 50 years. Must not listen to him. Ah! Ah! Uh, that's a bad idea! Come on, sis, let's go home! Aki... Haru? Did you hear that, Takuma? She just called him Hakiharu! Yeah, she can hear us now! She can hear the professor! I'm here too, Miyuki! I also came to save you! You came to save me? Sis! Miyuki! Professor Renamon, stay back! Does it get, like, a stat decrease? Or was that just, you know, you know, plot? 
Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh, fucking make sure. Yep, get rid of all that. Get rid of you. Yeah, do it, hit him, see what happens. That uh, is decent. But the accuracy is so fucked, I'm not even gonna bother. I'm just gonna keep boosting... Well, no, I guess I'm gonna boost myself. My trade! Finally, get that stupid fucking frog out of here. And then we'll boost up, uh, War Greymon. You know what? We'll put uh, my Otis Mon over here because it might add another target. Yeah, another frog. It's fine. It's fine. More plot? No, hearing our voices again wasn't enough. Pull yourself together, we're not gonna lose her again. Please, listen to me, I'm begging you. It's over. Her mind has sunken away forever now. What if... Renamon, try communicating with her in your true form. I've tried that before, but it never works. Just me isn't enough. Don't be so quick to write yourself off. When I saw Gabumon again, I realized how deep human and monster bonds really are. It should have the same effect on Miyuki, I'm sure of it. I think it's gonna work this time. In our world, Miyuki always used to say she felt like half her soul was missing. But the Master has her whole soul, so maybe now you can reach her. But, but if it doesn't work, I... I trust Takuma with all my heart. We have something special together, like brothers. It's the same for you and Miyuki. Believe in her. Believe in your bond. Miyuki, can you hear me? Didn't I tell you it's hopeless? Give up already! I don't care how many times she forgets herself and loses control to the master. I will never give up on Miyuki. I'll never give up on getting her back. Oh. Listen to me, Miyuki. You are my other half. Renamon's getting closer to Miyuki. Look on her face. That's not the master. That's really her. Is that you, Haru? You might not have realized it, but I've been waiting so long to have you back. All I really wanted was to see you look at me again. This can't be... No, Rena! Ah! Sis! Miyuki! I can't... I... Huh? No, I... I am the master of the world! Renamon, run! I'll just stand here. Uh, okay. Another cutscene. Stop it. Stop chasing after me. Miyuki. Sis. Wait, they aren't chasing me. No, they're calling to me? Who? Who is it? Who's there? 
Sis, sis, sister! Miyuki, Miyuki! That's my brother and my friend. I have to go. I have to go. I have to get out of here right now to see them. Oh, no, you don't. I won't let you go. Stop it. I have to go right now. Ah! Fuck it, another one! Why even bother stopping? Aru? Uh, Is Miyuki back to normal now? So you can still recognize me, even with all these wrinkles. Your eyes haven't changed one bit. And Renamon, you haven't changed at all either. Oh, Miyuki, I finally get to hear you say my name again. Sorry for keeping you waiting so long. It's okay, just having you back means the world to me. I wanted to come back too, you know. But where are we anyway? Guys, save that for later, we need to skedad- Yeah, we're not taking the whole fucking thing with us! Saving Miyuki's priority number one, like we discussed, remember? Akiharu, run him on, let's get Miyuki out of here! Okay, bye, Gabumon. All right, everyone, we've got Miyuki. Now it's time to escape. Let's pull her out of there first! Wait, I can't move. Something's, something's coming from behind. You can't have her. My priestess will bring my ultimate desire to fruition! Oh, I, I can't. Too strong! Damn it, we can't let that hand grab Miyuki. Run! I'm, I'm still under control. No, Miyuki! I promised I'd never abandon you again. That's why I have to... I, I get away from Miyuki! Akiharu, don't! The professor's trying to pry Miyuki free from the master. Ugh, pitiful. Stop, professor, it's too dangerous, let's go already! I can't, I'll never let go of her again. Then I'll tear you apart. Look out! I'm not gonna let this happen, not on my watch! No! Oh, God! Oh, no! The master's hand pierced Renamon's body. Haru, hurry! Why would you protect me? Hurry, save me, Yuki! What's going on? Renamon, what are you doing? It's okay, Miyuki. Nothing for you to worry about. So please... Uh, no, this can't be happening. And it's all my fault! Don't feel bad. I'm just happy I could protect you. If you and your brother... If you two are both okay, then I... Oh, God! Okay, Renamon's fucking dead! I leave the rest to you, the real Haru. Go now, save your sister. Jesus! Renamon, no! Renamon! You mean so much to me, my destined partner, Miyuki. Oh, shit! Renamon, no! Ah! Sis! No, Miyuki, stay with us! Is fucking Haru gonna get fucking stabbed now, too? The girl shall never return. I shall never allow it! Damn, he's back again. Damn it all, Takuma! We finally make it this far, and now we lose another one of us? What do we do now, Takuma? Keep going or pull back? It's over. We have no chance. We have to run. It was reckless of us to face him in the first place. Keep it together, Takuma, or else none of us will make it. Damn it, if Takuma isn't running, then neither am I. Don't be reckless, Minoru. Everyone's freaking out. 
If we're gonna do something crazy, now's the time. We're with you, Minoru. No, Kaido, you'll die! Sis, I... I just wanted to. The professor's in the depths of despair. What about me? What the hell should I do? I'm here with you, Takuma! I always will be! Don't forget that! Thank you, Agumon. If you start to falter, just lean on me. Even if you think you can't go on, I'll never give up on you. On your future. I'll make sure you don't have anything to worry about or fear. Are you trying to say it's too soon to give up? And it's okay to want to rescue Miyu Miyuki? It's okay to want to save the world? Of course it is, and I'll make those wishes come true! Ha! Huh. Looks like they beat me to it, Akiharu! What do you mean, Gabumon? You're just like him. You'd never give up on her. You said you promised to save Miyuki this time, didn't you? Yes, but in the end, I... Renamon was willing to risk her life because you didn't give up. Let me support you. I'm your partner through anything and everything. If you can't save Miyuki on your own, I'll give you the extra push you need. I'm done with questioning myself, Professor. We have Agumon and the others with us. They're our partners in battle to the end. So please don't give up. Together we can rescue Miyuki and... Then we'll save the world, I swear it! Are we gonna get fucking Omnimon here? Right. You're right, Takuma. We have a purpose! To save my sister, that's the only path forward! What's happening? I feel all hot inside. Uh, this is like nothing I've ever felt before. So many feelings. Oh my god! Agumon, Gabumon, what's going on with you two? I feel the intensity of Takuma's emotions. It's like I've always been waiting for this. Same for me, I feel the power of Akiharu's resolve surging inside me. I can't take it anymore! Our current forms can't handle such intense emotions, Agumon! You're right, we must become one! Agumon, Digivolve 2! Gabumon, Digivolve 2! Oh god, they're gonna fucking do it! There it is! There's the big boy! We got the big guns! You're fucked now, Miyuki! Holy night. Omega Mon. Why have I been calling him Omni Mon? Who the fuck is Omni Mon? Hold on. Omni Mon. No, that's Omni Mon! Wait. Hold on. He's also called Omni Mon. Which one is it? Uh. Ba -ba -ba. Is he called... Hold on. Omegamon. Omegamon versus... Omnimon. It has always been Omegamon. Omnimon was just the dubbed version in the first movie. Okay, so yeah, I get Omnimon, Omegamon, whatever. It's both the same. Agumon and Gabumon merged into one? How can this be happening? Takuma, Akiharu, I, Omegamon, will handle this. Omegamon? Is this for real? This could turn the tide. Maybe we have a better chance now. We do, we're gonna make it! We're following you, Takuma! Okay, Omegamon, can you get Miyuki free for us? 
We're counting on you, Omega Mon. Please save my sister. No problem. Leave it to me. Except where War Greymon was, we're probably going to get fucking swatted here. Alright, well, I was going to say with my dying breath, but we're still here. We're going to heal ourselves up because we'll hopefully still be a target. Alright, Omega Mon, let's see what you got. Show me what you've got. Supreme Cannon deals water damage to targets, freezing them. So we gotta do it right here. Big damage. Big damage! And he's frozen, so he can't fucking hit us! Alright, and then we can get a back attack, which will hopefully end the fight. We're a super ultimate. I mean, my Otis Mont could finish the fight right here. Alright! Returned to the fold. Why? Why? How can this be happening? I'm coming, Miyuki. I'll free you from his, from his grasp. But please! Oh! Oh, that's Omega Mon. I, th I thought fucking. Eh, whatever. Ah, I just keep slapping around in there, something will happen. Alright, hey, I wasn't expecting it to get Omnimon so fucking. Early, I guess? I thought it was gonna be saved for, like, uh... The true route. But whatever, I'd fucking throw it in here. It's fine. We only got a perfect enlightenment slab, not a mega one. So fucking sure, whatever. Oh. It was that- Oh, and Renamon's fine! Somehow we were able to free Miyuki from the Master. But we paid a price for it. Alright, so let's just take a look here. Yeah, that's an all that's an Omnimon right there. 20 SP. I assume we need a a Gabumon on our mission at the same time to turn into it though. Renamon! Ah oh, no, this light! It can't be! No, don't die, Renamon! Don't cry. I never want that smile to leave your face. We got you back, and I got to hear you say my name again. That's all I ever wanted. I... I can't believe this! After we were finally reunited! Don't worry, he's by your side now. The real Haru. But I don't want you to die! Don't leave us without you! Remember what we promised all those years ago? That the four of us would stay together? We did promise that. And now we're together again, at last. After I made you wait so long too! But now is our time to be together, not apart! You can't leave us here, I refuse! That would make me so sad! Akiharu? The professor's acting like a little kid. I guess two Haros weren't enough. Ah. I leave her to you now. Renamon! Renamon! Renamon's smile was so calm and gentle as she said farewell. The light that was once Renamon went into Miyuki's hands, stained by her tears. Ah! Uh. Miyuki's tears merged with the particles of the light. This warmth, 
The warmth of Renamon's life. It's a Digi-Egg. Digimon don't ever die. They just turn into a fucking egg. Renamon isn't gone. I can feel it. Huh? What do you mean? I can feel Renamon's life force. She's alive and we'll meet again. I know it. Is that even possible? Then again, the light is still in her hand and hasn't disappeared. I bet she's right. Someday they really will meet again. I'll be waiting for you, Renamon. You waited for me for so long, after all. I'll be waiting for... I'll be waiting with you, sis. Isn't it gonna be a little weird to be, like, a fucking 60-year-old man and, like, an 11-year-old girl? Yeah, it's my sister! Yeah, that's not weird. Count me in, too. Thank you, everyone. I feel like we have Miyuki back for good this time. But we still don't have time to hang around here for too long. Guys, we should get out of here. So if Miyuki would just open the gate to our world now... I was thinking the same thing. Sorry to put you on the spot, Miyuki, but would you mind? That's... not possible now. What? Why not? I have to be in the master's space and can only use my power when the time comes. Sounds complicated, so there's no avoiding it. Yep, we have to deal with the master after all. Was that not the master?! I knew it. Sorry everyone, I didn't know things would turn out this way. Looks like we have to defeat the master and fix what's wrong with this world. Or else our world will be destroyed too. This is all going way over my head. But why will our world be destroyed if we don't save this one? I suppose this might be a good time to explain. Ahem. For generations, the Manase family has served as Shinto priests in the area of Kana Kanobe. My sister Miyuki possesses the power of the gods. She was raised as a shrine maiden. So that's why she has those strange powers? Exactly. Shrine maidens connect this world to ours. And their duty is to maintain the equilibrium between the two worlds. Manase legends say the worlds are two sides of one coin. Just as we saw in the murals. I saw that for myself when I went back to our world. This world affects ours somehow. They influence each other. So now the equilibrium is out of whack? Let me guess, it's because the master messed up the balance? Perhaps, although humans' lack of belief is surely also to blame. Assuming that belief in Kimonogame helps balance the two worlds, then it follows that weakening of belief will could disrupt the balance over time. So a lack of belief caused all this? Sheesh! Do you recall what Takuma said about this earlier? So wouldn't this be fixed if we just go back with our Digimon and say, Hey, these are Kimonogame, they're real! Huh? Something? I said something? I don't- I don't think I remember. What was it? Well, if I recall correctly, you put it something like this. The gods have a faint presence. We treat them as if they don't exist. I guess I did say that, come to think of it. If we negate their existence by continually ignoring them, they grow weaker. All things that cannot be seen are the same in this regard. Or so I believe. Uh, Professor, this is getting pretty out there. I'm lost. I think I get what he's saying. As humans forget about this world, it starts to become warped in a way. So the whole world will be destroyed if we stop believing in it? Yeah, right. <sighs> Belief leads to action. So it's a simple fact that it affects one's environment. On a larger scale over time, who's to say it couldn't affect other dimensions? So did I cause this by leading- by leaving our world 50 years ago? I'm afraid that's possible. Shrine maidens maintain the people's belief, after all. Oh no. Not that she had a choice, it seems. Don't worry, sis. There might still be a chance. I sure hope so, Haru. What kind of ch what kind of chance? What are you saying we should do, Professor? We need humanity's strength. We must bolster people's belief to maintain this world. So if we go back to our world and spread awareness of this one, it'll be saved? 
I think that is very likely the case. In other words, we need more people like you who believe in us. And you expect people back home to believe what we say? Yeah, we're just some middle school students. Who'd listen to us? We must try. There are always some who believe in gods and the supernatural. I think it's possible. If anyone is capable of it, all of you are. The look in the professor's eyes make me think we can really do it. Weird. I'm sure you'll figure it out somehow. You made it this far, didn't you? Oh, come on. It won't be that simple. What if we all work together? Yeah, there might be a way we can help, too. Totally, let's figure out a way to be useful. We want to save this world too, you know? But this whole spreading belief thing is after we get back to our world, right? True. So if we don't get back somehow, then none of it matters. We need to figure out what we're doing next. Kaido's pointing to the path that leads deeper inside. We know where that would lead us. Nothing will change unless we act. We must defeat the master to go home. Then we have to tell people about this world. That will protect this world and keep Agumon and the others safe. It has to. <laughs> Kaido's right. Come on, guys. We're taking it to the master. Yes, I've been waiting for you to say that. We've come this far. We can't turn back now. We have no choice at this point. I won't try to stop it. We have to finish what we started. Count me in. We'll do our best, too. We're always here, right by your side. Just look at us, Takuma. Everyone's eager to get the job done. Thank you, everyone. Fools! What? Children of sacrifice, if you dare to face me, it will bring nothing but despair. That voice. It's him! What the? An earthquake? Ah! No, this is something else. Careful, everyone! Out of my way, you sacrificial lambs! Be gone! Ah. Takuma! We got thrown off by the shaking and didn't notice until it was too late. Legs collapsed, bodies thrown in the air. It's so dark, almost as if the darkness is trying to swallow us up. Okay, so there is 12 chapters. All right. So I'm going to assume this is going to take a... Oh, okay. Wait, are we back in the... Re okay, never mind. I'm going to assume this is going to take the... Uh, basically what happened in Digimon Adventure. Where uh, they were thrown into the abyss. The void. And uh, they had to... Uh, what was it? They had to come- they- What was it? They had to overcome their weaknesses. And their disbeliefs. And truly believe. They gotta believe! And then they fought, uh... Apocalamon. In the void. And they exploded, and then they sealed them with their digivices. But we don't have digivices, so, you know, it's gonna be a bit of a problem. But, uh, yeah! It's- Weird that we got uh, Omnimon in the second last chapter, not the last one. So that means we can just go into the last battle and just be like, yeah, here's Omnimon. Bada boom. It's weird because usually Omnimon is the problem solver. He is, he is the big, like, okay, we win. So just having him now is going to be weird, but uh, yeah. And we did, uh, we did suffer another casualty, Renamon. So technically we did lose one of our Megas, but we gained even bigger. We, we got a, a bigger ring. We got a, a better than Mega. So, eh, so we'll have to see. We'll have to see. So yeah, that's going to be it for tonight. Uh, we'll be finishing this off in, uh on Wednesday. We'll see if we actually get back to the real world. I imagine there's there's going to be something that goes wrong. Like, it's not going to be a 100% like happy ending. They would most likely save that for the real ending, but 
Who the fuck knows? We'll fucking see on Wednesday, and then maybe we'll even see if it's even worth getting a true ending. Though it would be nice to, you know, know something about Ryo, because... He died in, like, what, chapter 3 or 4? We know nothing about him, so... Yeah, that's that's pretty much gonna be it. So, uh, thanks everybody for tuning in. Uh, we'll be back on Tuesday to start Deltarune, which is great, because I've been looking forward to it. It's Undertale, but... Better? I don't know if I can say better, because Undertale's real good, but Deltarune's also good. So I don't know, we'll, we'll judge it when we get back to it. But uh, for now, I'm going to bed. It's fucking 4.30. Uh, thanks everybody for tuning in. And uh, yeah, we'll see everybody next time for Deltarune. See you then.